The cuts from the diamond saw were the best comparison to those found on the stone blocks at Pumapunku. So we're talking about the sharpest, most sophisticated cutting tool we have today. So how could a so-called primitive society have achieved such sophisticated stone carving techniques? Check out this block right here. There's something really cool about this one. First, I wanted to show you true north on my compass, which, as you can see, this is true north. Now watch what happens. All of a sudden, true north is over there. It's in the complete opposite direction. And here, even more so, down there. This is wild. So what is going on here? Clearly, this rock has been somehow magnetized. So was it exposed to some electromagnetic waves? Or is it like this because at some point, these blocks underwent or came in contact with something strange? I mean, this whole place is bizarre. Below the plateau where the H blocks are located are the steps and walls marking the edges of the Puma Punku Mound. Now I can truly see the scale of the site. <laughs> 